Um, hi. <laughs> it's been two months. No, it's been one month and some change. Yeah, man, we've been hyper busy on all of the other stuff that we're supposed to be doing, all the other shows and things like that. We've been hyper busy and we've been trying to remain consistent so that y'all don't lose any content. In the midst of that, certain things get missed and you guys aren't the only ones, the Dragon Ball people, the Berserk people have been like, yo, what the fuck? Where's my manga at? I'm sorry. Today, I found some time to do two chapters in one. So, Raphael, I hope you enjoy editing this one. <laughs> yeah, I'm totally sorry. I, I can't even, I can't even like, we really are trying to remain consistent and things are suffering elsewhere. So, um, and it's not a bad thing. Like, don't take that as a bad thing. Like, I'd much rather be late on the manga than to be late on anything else, right? However, there are still people who want to see this. And I know I'm super late. That shit sucks. But we're going to do both. And just in case you wanted to see my reaction to it, right? I'm going to do uh, chapter 83 and chapter 84 in one. So, I'm not going to hold you with this long ass intro because it's going to be long enough trying to read this whole 96 pages. Let's get right into it. So, YouTube, my cousin. <laughs> Check it out. Last episode, we saw, let me see if I remember, Goku was fighting gas. And they was teleporting all over the place. Oh, right. And then Goku fucking, uh, he bugged out when he heard Bardock or something like that. Something crazy like that. Now we need to figure out what's going to happen next. Which is crazy that I wasn't like, yeah, I need to read that shit now. Which I should have been that way. But I guess because waiting a month. I know I keep, I say this shit every fucking. Waiting a month is trash. So I tend to forget. And, uh, you know, there's other things on the horizon that I'm excited for. But anyway, let's read these next two chapters. So if you like this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, hit the hell's bell so you don't miss out on any of our videos. Check out our Patreon and our social media. So we got Bardock, Gas, and Baby. What the fuck was his name? Granola. I'm never going to remember the Namekian's name. I think it's Monaito, but that could be somebody else. Bardock will take what fate hands us. You've done enough. Bam, that's nice. There's no reason for you to lay down your life here. Run and save yourself. What? That's crazy. <laughs> I should mention, you could flee right now, but the Saiyans aren't fated to last much longer anyway. Oh, yeah? What's that supposed to mean? Oh, nothing much. Just something I heard from Alec. Oh, I've heard enough cryptic crack out of you. Damn, so they knew? So Frieza probably told them. I love how this is filling in the blanks of like, you know, who knew, who didn't know, who didn't know. Like, remember when Beerus is the one who who said that Frieza could do it or whatever? Like, it's crazy hearing all of that shit. But the problem is, is that maybe Vegeta would be mad if he heard, but Bar uh, Goku probably wouldn't wouldn't give a shit. The ones who've got no future are you and your gang. <laughs> oh man, I like this Bardock. Damn. You ever get hit so hard on the top of your head you just bleed out the mouth? Fuck. Listen closely. This is my fight now. You're in the way. So get out of here. Yeah, I mean, yeah, bro. Your blows feel like pinpricks against catching tight. Catching tight? Is that like the hardest metal or something like that? That's the shit that Gohan broke the sword on, I think. Enough of these irritating sorry excuses for attacks. I said enough. Damn. Damn, Bardock. I cannot face, afford to waste any more time on you. You wouldn't mind if I unleash a bit of my inner nature, would you? Ooh, you gonna unleash that shit? Oh, the two Dragon Balls. Using the Dragon Balls for our own benefit is forbidden. But it should be okay if my wish helps someone from another planet. What is this wish about to be? Damn it. So your kind can just adjust their power levels, huh? Well, this is far from the full extent of my power, of the power slumbering within me. I suppose you've lost the will to fight back now. Yeah, you wish, bitch. What the fuck you think this shit is? I'm Bardock. Nothing gets my blood pumping like a powerful foe. <laughs> Enough. Then he got kicked square in the gut, bro. 
Yo, Gas is beating his ass. Wait, what? They summon the dragon? State your wish. If it is within my power, your single wish is my command. Send Bardock back to his home planet. Oh. Uh -huh. Hear me, Bardock. It is Monaito's wish that I should transport you to your home planet, Vegeta. What the? <laughs> Whose voice is this? I am the wish granting dragon known as Tarambo. Is that the first time you said his name? Tarambo. I like that. Who's he speaking with? Oh, the dragon. What is that? I'm afraid he has refused. A Saiyan would rather die than run from an enemy. Damn, look at how brawlic gas is. Your attacks barely tickle. It's funny how he says that. Your attacks barely tickle, but look at him. Look at him, a whole bitch. Got veins and shit everywhere. Damn. Listen, Bardock. So it's you this time, Monaito. Oh, I, I remembered his name. I sure wish you wouldn't put voices in my head. You showed real moral fiber saving us back there, and that was more than enough. I've got no doubt that the kindness in your heart is going to save someone else someday. That's why you need to live. Sorry, but I don't take orders from anyone except Frieza. And I'm not leaving this planet until I've beaten him. All right. What's it going to take to make you see reason? Fine, then. Tell me, is there another wish I could make for you? Mm, are you making a wish on a shooting star for something? I wish that my sons end up thriving. I wonder. Is that why Goku is always... But, I mean, Raditz didn't thrive. Raditz got fucked. Hmm. I wish for tasty food. I wish for tasty food. I wish for... <laughs> Quit it, idiot. Those probably aren't, aren't shooting stars. Oh, yeah, those are the Dragon Balls. Damn, so... What? He has the right idea. A wish is a way to create hope for the future. Selfish wishes can only bring about doom. And I was about to make a grave mistake. I meant to protect what hope we've got left with all I've got. Hmm. I wonder. See, like, it's cool. That wish thing is cool. But I need more detail because I don't want to speculate. Like, it's really cool, but, like, what what effect does that have on Goku and Raditz? Guess we'll see. You've overstayed your welcome. Oh, you got him by the tail. Fucking bastard. I don't like this gas dude, bro. I mean, he's cool, but I don't like him. I just slamming him around by the tail. Bardock's getting fucked. He ripped his tail off? Time out. I was always under the impression that only a child Saiyan's tail comes back. That's what I was under the impression of. And last I checked, in the canon Broly movie and the non-canon Bardock movie, he had his tail both times when he died. He had that shit. Now, unless I'm bugging, which I'm sure one of you will tell me, Unless I'm bugging, he had his fucking tail. I don't know. Let me know in the comments because I am sure he had his tail, at least in the Broly movie. Because I remember he had it wrapped around his stomach, and then when he hugged Gine, um, his tail came out. I was like, ooh, that's how you know they love each other. But anyway, no more giant ape form for you. It's over, saying He fucking snapped his tail off like a fucking... Like if it was detachable. Of course, Monaito is going to take it. Sorry about before, but I'm. But now I'm ready to protect Granola no matter what. So do me a favor and win this one for us, Bardock.
At every turn, you two insist on disrupting my work. Damn, so he powered up to Berserker? The Namekian you sought to protect is gone. And I, so I will soon track down and kill the child. As you die, know that you failed to protect anyone. What a bitch. That's not your call to make, and I'm not dying before I've beaten you. Then he blasted him in the chest. And then he punched him in the dick. <laughs> I'm sure he hit him in the face. I could tell by the art. But at first glance, he punched him smooth in the cock. And I'm fine with this. And now look, he's just beating the shit out of his crack. Look at his crotch. Punching that shit. <laughs> and then he kicked him in the crotch so much that he's bleeding from it. I see you, Toyotaro. I understand what you're getting at. Hopefully when you animate it, he's punching him in the dick too. What do you hope to achieve? Why battle a battle? Why fight a battle you cannot win? Is this atonement as you face death? Are you atoning for the sins of all sins by protecting the child? No. Revenge then? You give it into your rage over us? Killing the Namekian and the Cerellian woman? Wrong again. Then why? Why fight? What is it? Running through your skull as you battle. Yo, Bardock is cool as shit. Isn't it obvious by now? Look how he caught him. The fuck is wrong with you? In a life and death battle, what sort of idiot would think about anything else besides victory? Mm-hmm. Then he duffed his bitch ass. A fight when there's an enemy I want to beat down. Nothing more to it. I respect this. Kick his ass, Bardock. How are you doing this? You Saiyans have no ascended states beyond the Great Ape. You're ignorant and that's my fault? Nah. We Saiyans have a way of growing and evolving every time we push past our limits. That's absurd. I represent a limit that no lowly Saiyan can surpass. That's crazy. They always doing that to Saiyans, bro. <laughs> Damn, he is fucking him up. He's making him barf out the mouth. That he's fucking him up. He went and let his inner nature loose. <laughs> I'm ending this. Oh, fuck. Imagine... Imagine getting fucked so hard you turn into a baby. <laughs> That's the first thing I could think of. Imagine getting your ass beat so hard you turn into a baby. That's crazy. He look like a smooth toddler right here, bro. Look at him. He look like a whole toddler. That shit is crazy. But Bardock blasted the fuck out this guy. He, he hit him with the Goku Frieza blast. I didn't think you'd lose control after unleashing yourself. A real shame. We'll have to double down on training. Really? He's still alive? Of course. I thought you were loyal to Frieza. When it comes to business, there's the hand you show and the hand you don't. Speaking of, your kind doesn't even know what Frieza is really planning, right? You Saiyans are such gullible saps. While you're in a daze playing catch up, don't be surprised if a media drops on your head. You know what's crazy about that? So, in the canon movie, 
It made it. To, it made it so he was psychic. But in the Broly movie, he just had a hunch, like a bad feeling. But come to find out, he knew all along. He knew all along. Explain what you mean. Wouldn't you like to know? Well, how about nah? Oh, and you shot my man's. Freezer ship is incoming. Get your butt over here. Damn. <laughs> he just fucking shot Bardock. What the fuck? And then he missed every other shot. Bardock, are you still alive? I'd ask you the same thing, Monaito. Takes more than that to put an Amekian down. <laughs> it's crazy when you think about them on like the power scale. They were all like super weak. You don't say. Good. I take it the Australian kid is okay too. Yep, he is. Those thugs left us for dead and headed off. You won the battle, Bardock. The audio's data ends there. Damn, that whole thing was just the audio from the fucking... It must have been like listening to the radio back in the day when you would watch boxing matches. Bardock left this planet as soon as he was on his feet again. Only his scouter was left behind. I wonder... I love this. Look at little Goku, bro. I love this. So he came back. He came back after the battle. And he saw his son. And I guess he healed up and left. And then when he came back is when he was like, oh, they're going to, Freeza's going to kill us. Yeah. Damn, so Goku remembers? I finally feel like... I feel like I finally understand what Saiyan Pride is. I remembered what it's about along with my dad's face. The thing is, I haven't had total faith in my power. I lost sight of it as, of it as well. My burden is not the sins of all Saiyans, but our people's pride. Damn, Vegeta's looking buff as shit, bro. I wish I could get that buff. I'm gonna have to. I gotta get that buff. Why did it have to be your father of all people who helped me realize this? And to think that you and Raditz survived when you were young because of a wish on the Dragon Balls. That's crazy. That's crazy. So, because of that, Raditz was off planet and they sent Goku off. Wishing for you to thrive and all. Whoever heard of such pampered sayings? How about the way you, you pamper and spoil, brah? <laughs> One thing has nothing to do with the other. Bardock, what a funny way for your will to be passed on. Yeah. A people's pride isn't about atoning for sins of the past. And it ain't about taking revenge. It's all about accepting your nature and sticking to your convictions. I like that. And that's true of any tribe out there. I really like that. Over here, you two. Let me patch you up a bit before Gas gets back. But first, your clothes... Oh, you didn't put Saiyan armor on them? <laughs> Can I just have my original outfit back? Do you want to dress like, dress how Bardock once did? <laughs> I can't get used to this jacket. <laughs> Aw. They actually did change out of their outfits. That sucks. I was hoping he would see him in Bardock's gear. Gas is back. Get out here, Saiyans. Sooner than we thought. So... Since a selfish wish gets uh, brings doom, then I wonder what's going to happen with gas. Like, will he just die? He's going to kill over and die. Hey there, brother. How are you feeling? I'm feeling like I just wasted too much time. Tell Elect that I'll be finished here shortly. Okay. We'll have a tasty meal waiting for you. I assumed you would have run off by now. 
it's you and your gang who need to leave. Leave. We plan to as soon as I've slaughtered you two. I want to defeat this one even if it kills me. How about you? Well, I'm not letting you have all the fun. Fine, we fight together then. That's crazy. That's so unlike Vegeta, but it's so like Vegeta these days for him to want to fight. Like, he just offered it up. That shit is crazy. I'll be the one to end this. Not on my watch. <laughs> oh! Yo, that picture? This one right here? Oh, shit. This is cool. I actually really fuck with this picture. This picture is OD. Damn, look at their power just shooting up. <laughs> Yikes. Damn. What sort of forms are they using? That Goku guy is using super duper instinct. And Vegeta's got his massive ego boost thing, I think. <laughs> like, I give a crap about those names. I'm asking if they're strong or not. Oh, yeah, for sure. Real strong. You intend to face me together? Saiyans are as mindless as ever, I see. You still fail to comprehend that such a strategy will not matter given the gulf, the gulf between us. I guess the gap? The distance? No, you're the one who doesn't get it. It's got nothing to do with our odds of victory. What drives us now is the sheer desire to win. That's that Bardock shit. Mm-hmm. Damn, he just blocked both of them. But Vegeta, so Vegeta gets stronger. <laughs> yeah, about what I expected. That's crazy. So Vegeta gets stronger the more he's damaged. But Goku just can't really be hit. Damn, I cannot wait to see this shit animated. This shit is crazy. I really can't wait to see this shit animated. Yeah, they're they're fucking brawling. Vegeta got punched in the head, but that fist looks kind of weird. Oh no, he. That's Vegeta's hand. Okay, that's Vegeta's hand and Gas's hand. Got it. And Goku got kicked in the face. I'm surprised. I'm super surprised that Goku's like getting hit in, in MUI. But I guess now that they said that there's levels to it, it makes sense. But I wonder like how many levels and what each level will look like. Yeah, he tried to end them. Look at the Gallic Hulk. Oh. Kamehameha. Yeah, bro. I love when they do that shit. What makes it even cooler is when it wraps around. Oh, damn. He just got the fuck out of there. He's behind him with a fuck. Of course you hit Vegeta. Vegeta is always the one that gets hit. Yeah, it's so weird. I thought Ultra Instinct, his body just moves on its own. Don't get cocky, you pathetic monkeys. Move aside, Kakarot. This is a god of destruction move, one capable of erasing mere mortals. If you're truly the strongest, universe is strongest, then try standing up to this. He always does that bluff shit. Stay right there. Observe as I deflect your worthless move. Damn. This is fuck. This shit, when this gets animated, is going to be fire. It's going to be fire. And I hope they show this Ultra Ego shit in the superhero movie. Is he going to be okay? Gas is losing ground to them. They'd already used those transformations, right, Oil? Yep, I saw both those forms when they were duking it out with Granola. Then he's fine. The wish to make him the strongest came after that. Oh, uh, true. He can still win this. Relax. I assume they might team up against him as the strongest in the universe. Uh... Gas outclasses Granola. Just watch. Yep. Damn it, we're getting pushed back. It's no use. Vegeta, come on. He just jumped out. What the fuck? Damn, 
<clears throat> so he went to fight him head on and got kicked in the fucking gut again. He kicked him so hard that his fucking his clothes ripped. What's wrong, saying losing too much blood? Still think you can, can win? Why wouldn't I? Say your save your prattle for the afterlife. That's crazy. I wish he could have kicked it back to him while his back was turned. <laughs> he punched the shit out of him. Oh. <laughs> oh. Yeah. You worm. What trick is this? How's your body still moving? Damage is nothing but fuel for me. Mm-hmm. Do you realize what that means? I'm only getting stronger, bitch. Uh, that's it? Now we got to wait another month. Why do I have a feeling they're going to do our boy dirty? I just have a feeling they're going to do our man dirty. It's so cool that they powered up together, though. I wonder what that's going to look like when they animate it. And people keep drawing his hair purple. But is there any confirmation that his hair is purple in that Ultra Ego form? I don't know. That'd be crazy if his hair is like green or I guess it would have to be a dark color can't be red I, I mean i guess it would be purple because <laughs> it can't be blue can't be yellow can't be red can't be pink yeah i guess the only other color would be purple that was a fire chapter because i really felt like the battle you know what i'm saying like that battle looked crazy and when they animate it fuck it's gonna look so good when they animate it especially when they powered up together like, what color is that going to be? Oh, God. It's going to be... Oh, man. It's going to be so good. It's going to be so good. This arc is going to be so good. The The moral arc was good, too. It was good. But this one... This one. This one's going to be fucking lit when they decide to animate it. So, I was hoping we would get some sort of news about Super coming back. This, you know, this go around with the whole superhero thing happening, but maybe next year because of superheroes i don't know i know they know that people want super back because all of the movies do really well like the movies do really well so i don't know what would make them think that we don't want more dragon ball movies not movies but like dragon ball super they should give us more dragon ball bro i don't know they just make us wait so long for everything because now when does the superhero movie come out I think it comes out in June, no, July in Japan, something like that. It's soon in Japan, and I think we get it right after. I think we get it in August or something like that. I don't know. I have to look it up. I've tried, I've been trying to stay away from all news Dragon Ball related because I want to watch the movie blind so that when I come out, we can talk about it. Because, of course, Julie's going to come with me because she's already caught up with everything um, except the manga, so... When they talk about stuff that's happening in the manga, if they talk about stuff that happened in the manga, um, then we'll see. Because apparently it's supposed to be after this, isn't it? So I'm hoping they show Ultra Ego and, you know, at least like in a flashback or, you know, he just pulls it out or some. I don't know. I'm hoping that we at least get Ultra Ego. But anyway that's my two cents i hope you enjoyed this video we'll be on time next month i promise or this month we'll be on time um now i gotta get to doing berserk so i love you guys if you like this video forget to like subscribe hit the hell's bell so you don't miss out on any of our videos check out our patreon and our social media and i'll see you in the next one <laughs>